will be here to discuss my research topic which is all about the waste management awareness and practices of students at Resi Martyr City National High School, Concho Annex as a basis for waste management reduction project. Introduction. In pursuant to the DepEd Order 226 series of 2019 about prohibiting the use of single plastic products in all public schools, extension offices, and the division of Cavite, that everyone in the school must strictly follow and from DepEd Order 228 series of 2018 on ecological solid waste management states that the use of proper waste disposal of thorough segregation mechanism like the use of yellow trash bin for biodegradable and red trash bin for non-biodegradable and blue trash bin for recyclable and reusable and for the waste prop papers for storage boxes on designated areas inside the office. The above act and memorandum given eagerness me as a researcher to utilize it in the school. This helped improve the waste storage and disposal before, after, during the school year. In line with this, the researcher will conduct a survey question about the level of awareness and practices of the school. With the support of the teachers, students, and administrators, the result of this study will be a big help to improve the waste management in the school. Research question. Research question number one. What is the respondent's profile in terms of age, sex, and grade level? Research question number two. What is the level of waste management awareness of respondents on how to reduce, reuse, and recycle. Research question number three, what is the level of manage waste management practices of the respondents on how to reduce, reuse, and recycle? Research question number four, what significance does exist between the level of waste management awareness and practices of the respondents? Respondent's status was the basis, or the respondent's status was the basis for the selecting 50 respondents distributed into grade 7 high school students, grade 8 high school students, grade 9 high school students, and grade 10 high school students of Tresi Martyr City National High School, Concho Annex, and it was administered on the school year 2019-2020. the population into clusters. Clusters are randomly selected and all members of the cluster are sampled, wherein this method which belongs to probability sampling. Letter B, data collection. Meeting with the respondents and gain acceptance of their participation in the research was done. The researcher was in touch with them and asked them to participate in the research after explaining the nature and the scope of the study. In general terms, the respondents are were willing to participate in the research. After the validation of the instrument by the three experts, the researcher will reproduce at least 50 copies of instrument for the grade 7, grade 8, grade 9, and grade 10 high school students. Letter C, Ethical Issues. A letter informed consent was given to the students and parents as an accept acceptance of participation of their children in the study. Letter D. Data Analysis Plan Number 1. We have the mean. Mean was used to determine the level of awareness and practices of waste management. Number 2. Person R correlation or the Spearman row was used to determine the relationship between students' awareness and practices on waste management. As shown on Figure 1, as shown of the 50 respondents, 52% belong to the 14 to 16 years old, 42% belong to 10 to 13 years old, and 6% belongs to 17 to 18 age bracket. Among evaluators, those within the age bracket 
40 to 60 years was the highest number of respondents, while the least number was in the age bracket of 17 to 90 years old. For the profile sex, as shown on figure, it is shown there that female had the highest number of respondents, which has 66%, and the remaining 34% are the male respondents. Grade level. So, as shown in figure D, the profile of the respondents in terms of grade level, so grade 9 has the highest number of respondents, which has a percentage of 31, and the next one is 29% from the grade 10 students, and next is from the grade 7, which has 22%, and the least number were from the grade 8, which has 18%. Level of Waste Management Awareness of Respondents On the level of awareness, we have reusing, which has 41.50, has the highest number. Compared to recycling, with 41.18, and the least was reducing, which has a summation or a mean summary of 38.76. This result states that, there are more aware of reusing than recycling and have at least awareness on reducing a waste among students at Resi Martyrs City National High School, Poncho Annex. On the level of waste management practices of the respondent, among the respondents, the most practice was reducing with a total mean of 38.64. Second was reusing with a total mean of 36.20 and the least was recycling with a total mean of 36.02 which is about all about waste management. This study clearly or this result clearly identified that students practice more on reducing than reusing and had minimal practice on recycling the waste materials. Relationship between level of waste management awareness and practices of the respondents. As shown on table 3, it shows the significant relationship between the waste management awareness and practices. In conclusions, the printouts from SPSS indicate that the strength in relationship between the awareness and practices is very high or had a very po close positive result of R which is equal to 0.670 and that the correlation was high significant with a significance of 0 0.000 which is lower than the alpha level of 0 0.05. Therefore, we could say that on the significant relationship between the level of management awareness and practices of the respondents, the result in person R on table 3 shows a strong relationship between level of awareness and practices on waste management of the respondents. It was clearly stated on the result that the students practice, practice on waste management will rely on their waste management awareness. Conclusion Based on the findings of the study, the following conclusions were drawn. The study should be implemented using the Waste Management Project as an action research by this time. As shown on the given result and discussion, an immediate implement implementation of the project should be done as a solution to the problem, especially about awareness and practices of the students in school or even outside. Hello everyone! Thank you for watching! Thank you.